Here some jackfruit. So nice. I love jackfruit. Mmm. Sujata, jackfruit is very nice. Mmm. Sujata, can you please dispose these seeds? You are saying this. Don't we know we can use the seeds? This is so disappointing, yeah. This is so irritating, yeah. If Lakshmanan is so dismissive about these jackfruit seeds, then I suspect most people will be chucking them away. But after you watch this video, you will definitely not chuck them away. Today, eating a ripe jackfruit has become a rarity among the urban masses and I suspect that the millennials may not even have tasted it. And before we go further, why don't you drop me a comment whether you like ripe jackfruit or not and if there are lots of responses, I can plan a special episode on benefits of ripe jackfruit. Jackfruit seeds are edible. Are you alarmed hearing this? Yes. Jackfruit seeds are indeed edible, very tasty. So hang on until the mull point to know the various ways in which jackfruit seeds could be used. By the way, the nutritional and antioxidant properties of jackfruit seeds have not yet been fully explored. But what is known so far itself makes me think that what a nutritional marvel these seeds are. Let's check it out. Jackfruit seeds provide an ample supply of protein, fiber and carbs. On dry weight basis, these seeds have over 60% starch and about 8% protein. But what is more exciting are the micronutrients and minerals. Here are the top ones. Potassium almost as much as in bananas, magnesium and calcium. Other minerals include phosphorus, sodium, iron, zinc, copper etc. Of particular importance is the high levels of carotenoids in these seeds which are required for the body to produce vitamin A. So not only do the seeds have vitamin A but they also help our body produce more vitamin A. Besides, thiamine and riboflavin are also found here. One interesting chemical, jacalin, is a protein derived from jackfruit seeds. This has been shown to be effective in strengthening the immunity against the HIV virus strain. Many studies point to the impact of these seeds in regulating blood sugar due to the combination of carotenoids, high dietary fiber and high level of resistant starch. The high fiber also supports weight loss. Multiple studies also indicate that jackfruit seeds are rich in many types of antioxidants. Further, a wide range of beneficial properties such as antibacterial, antifungal, antiviral, cytotoxic and anti-inflammatory properties has also been reported. The jackfruit seed is quite a jack of all trades, right? In many parts of South India, these seeds are collected from the ripe jackfruit. They are dried and stored for use in the rainy season. At the other end of the spectrum, science has come up with many innovative ideas of how to use these seeds. A low cost starch replacement in baked and confectionery products is one. This research paper is another very innovative example making an eco-friendly adhesive from the seed. With so much goodness packed onto the jackfruit seed, can you afford to miss out on this one? If you're new to Munchen Mal and you found this video useful so far, then do consider subscribing. Now, let me show you an ultra simple way to use these jackfruit seeds. So, what's the recipe today? I'm going to be making jackfruit seed dosa. Now, once you consume the jackfruit, remove the seeds, wash it and sun dry it for minimum one day. Only then actually this outer seed coat becomes brittle and you are able to remove this. See, this is the outer seed coat. You just have to peel this off. And this is the inner seed is what we are going to be using. Yeah. It's very popular for jackfruit seeds to be dry roasted over a chula or fire and having them with salt. But for our South Indian recipes, we cut them. So the way to cut it is just one longitudinal slit here and then each half you again cut it. So one seed, you cut it into four pieces. And if you remember, I have uploaded our Palakkad Ayer special Molagutal recipe. So jackfruit seeds can be added along with other vegetables to make the molagutal. It can be easy to cut. 
We have cut it like this to ease the grinding and also in other veggie preparations it's easily cooked this way. So here are the ingredients to make our jackfruit seed dosa. I've taken about one and a half cups of brown rice and I've soaked it in water for about three hours. Two fistfuls of diced jackfruit seeds, two to three tablespoons of freshly grated coconut, two green chilies, half a teaspoon of jeera, a small piece of sliced ginger and salt to taste. I've added ginger and jeera because some people they complain of gas issues after consuming jackfruit seeds. So here let's grind the batter for the jackfruit seed dosa. So I'm adding the soaked brown rice, adding the sliced jackfruit seeds, the coconut and the green chilli, ginger and cumin seeds and uh, here is a pro tip. I'm adding some curry leaves too, salt to taste. Now initially let's add a little water, we'll add water according to the consistency. If we add too much water, it will be difficult to grind it. So add it very judiciously. So let's start the grinding now. We'll add a little bit more water, it's slightly coarse, it's quite fine. We'll remove it and we can adjust the consistency of the batter once we start making the dosa. This is seems to be a right consistency, see this? So now we'll transfer this. So let's start making our jackfruit seed dosa. I have kept an iron tawa for heating, Just sprinkling a few drops of oil and this is some coconut fiber. Spread the oil on the tawa and this is our jackfruit seed dosa batter, Getting a little oil. Now let's just flip this, it looks so crispy and brown. So here I'll flip this again and here our jackfruit seed dosa is ready. It's now time to taste my jackfruit seed dosa. If you are a diabetic or if you want to prevent diabetes, this is good for you. I am having my jackfruit seed dosa with more kutan which I have made using ash cod. It can also be made using ripe mango. The recipe link is given above. Of course, dosa could also be had with chutney, sambar or dosha madaga pudi. How to make dosha madaga pudi or gunpowder? Manchanmal has got you covered. Here's the link. Yummy. You can't keep making jackfruit seed dosa every time you have jackfruit seeds. What are the other different ways in which we could use these seeds? Let's mull over it. In Tamil Nadu and Kerala, these seeds are just cut or crushed and added to recipes like kootu, molagootal, morkolambu, etc. You could even add this in my instant sambar recipe, the link of which is given above. You could even sun dry these jackfruit seeds and powder them to a fine flour. This powder can be added to either dosa batter, chapati dough or even gravy curries. Another interesting option is that you could even pressure cook these jackfruit seeds and mash them and add it to other vegetables to make delicious vegetable cutlets or you can mash them and turn them out into a delicious halwa recipe. Aren't these possibilities interesting? Maybe you have innovated some interesting jackfruit seed recipes. Why don't you share them with me in the comment section below? So now do start eating jackfruit, not just for the fruit, but also for the seed. I hope I have inspired you enough to spare the jackfruit seeds from being chucked into the dustbin. If yes, do support our initiatives by giving us a super thanks. Do check out the Manchanmal website for more services and products that we feel are beneficial for you. So until next time, bye bye. Hey, have you subscribed to Manchanmal? Do click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon to receive notifications of my newest videos uploaded every Saturday.